Hi guys, welcome to my channel. This is going to be for the rising sign in Libra. If you don't know your rising sign, there's a link down there and you can help yourself. Okay, so let's see what's going on, guys, with the situation that you are in for the Libra. Okay, let's see here. Libra rising. Okay. Let's see. Ace of Pentacles, good start, very, very, very good energy. Someone offering you something, engagement too, provided that you walk in the same path. It's a, it's a choice. You are, you can be connecting with an earth sign. Um, you have your, for the Libra rising, an earth sign offering you something. Both of you are meeting halfway. It's almost like someone wants to top over the other person. It's like, Someone wants to call it, like I offer you this, I, I someone wants to match it, basically. It's good energy. It's slow though. Okay. But you know, what is slow anyway, right? I know, you tell me. Because this person comes to you with precision, accuracy, that's what they that's what they want. They don't want to play around. Nine of Cups over here. If you take it slow and steady with this person, you're gonna be happy. Okay? And if you are connecting with a water sign too, or if they're not a water sign, whoever you're connecting with, Libra Rising, this person wishes what's good for you also. A nine of cups is not as is not they're, they're you know not I mean self-destructive because some people of course was gonna see it's self-indulgent, but they're not self-destructive. I don't see it. This offer brings you happiness, and their wish also for your happiness. And then you have your um, Knight of Cups. Look at that. Both um, nights over here, you have earth and water. You can plant a tree, basically. The relationship will grow, okay? Um, and you have your two horses, so it's almost like getting a chariot. It's gonna move, it's gonna go. One is in a spiritual form, meaning you feel this person's energy and you just know. The other thing is grounded, so that's the energy where you see manifestation that this person wants to spend time, wants to see you. That's a Knight of Pentacles. The Knight of Cups is a charmer. You look at their eyes and you're dazzled. You feel that you're Belle in Beauty and the Beast. Hopefully you're not dating the Beast. <laughs> yes, you guys. <laughs> Let's see here. Seven of Cups over here. Choices has to be made. This person made a choice already. Their choice was to stop everything and then proceed with one thing. A knight only focuses on one thing. They're not a king. They cannot control everything. So their attention right now is just to offer something. Either their cups or this time, you know, both though are being offered over here. Or this is what you're doing. Eight of Pentacles. This person can be a nine of Pentacles person because eight and nine, eight and one, of eight and... You know, eight and one pentacle over there, that's a nine of pentacles, showing that if the other person is nine of cups, the other is nine of pentacles, meaning confidence on their side. Person is, you know, physically healthy, they like good things in life, eat good at restaurant, you know, they take care of themselves, yoga, um, spinning, cycling, that's the nine of pentacles. And the other one is more on the, the nine of cups, the other person's energy is all about I want good things in life. I want to go to the spa. I just want to relax. That's the other person's energy. Both are in balance over here because you have your Eight of Pentacles. Someone is very, very focused. Their intention is to put things in order one by one, step by step, gradual, gradual, until it gets to the Ten of Pentacles. Um, so you could be connecting with an earth sign who likes things traditional, who doesn't rush things, and when you feel that they're not rushing it, sometimes you're going to feel that it's stagnant, but it's not. It's really the process that this connection is going towards. But some people feel like, say, oh, this is not going anywhere because it's not moving fast. Because everybody is just go, you know, like everybody wants the fire sign, but a fire sign is like a blazing fire. It just burns everything. You want someone who plants it to the ground like a tree. You want a relationship, plant it to the tree. You know, plant it to the ground earth and water then you get the fire right burn that tree you create a lot of energy that's the tree that you're seeing burning in the lover's card you plant it first before you get the lover's card six of wands over here a person is very ideal because one they're good looking you're good looking or they're good looking popular over here someone who travels they travel they come back bringing success 
they have respect for elders there's a good energy over here so i'm going to continue this uh, rising sign in libra thank you very much for watching have a wonderful wonderful day bye